Question 179. What is the most, most unusual thing that you've ever collected? Unusual? Um... I don't know, there's not been many things I have actually collected. I used to collect Smurfs. I love Smurfs. Um, and then some people would think that was unusual in and of itself. <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, I've been collecting Commodore 64s lately. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty unusual. I've got three of them now. <laughs> That's hardly a collection. Although I'm not quite sure what oh, constitutes a collection. It is considering how hard they are to get. <laughs> I'm not sure what constitutes a collection. Dust. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> the one I, I, I'm not sure either. No, this is in this like erasers. Are you talking about rubbers? <laughs> not like board erasers. Rub D rubbers? Yeah. Phasing? <laughs> we don't really call them. Know, we I, don't really call them meant, rubbers. Dave. I know what you meant, Dave. Pencil erasers. We don't tend to call Johnny's rubbers. Oh. Yeah. I mean, it's not. It's not an unheard of. For, but it's not. I don't think I've ever intentionally referred to that read referred to one as a rubber. Theological introspection the says Pokemon. I, I don't know that Pokemon is an unusual collecting thing because lots of people go and play stupid Pokemon games and collect Pokemon. And that's true. That's very true. Oh, I used to collect badges at one time. That's not that. Wait, there, wait, there, wait, there. Badges or badges? Badges, not badgers. <laughs> yeah. If you're collecting badges, is that why he's not in the chat at the moment? Yes, he's in hiding. <laughs> <laughs> what sort of badges? Uh, just Your fairy ones. ones. <laughs> just damn it, Jen. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, just, just just anything I used to collect. This was like when I was a kid. I used to do that. See, know, what's disturbing like... is it's something I have not in any way, shape, or form remembered for a very long time. But I have, I collected badges. <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, I I've collected st stickers before. I used to like stickers of all varying sorts and that. So yeah, I could probably well, say I collected well, stickers. I think I might have collected lots of things as a kid actually. I used to collect yeah. football stickers and that when I was a kid, you know, every year. But that, that was that was hardly unusual. That was like it was a yeah sort of every 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 boy used to do that back then. I did I did that for one year. I enjoyed that far more than the, the football it was that was on. Yeah. The only reason the only reason I know the name of any footballers when I was growing up was from that one sticker album. Well, and then, it's, <laughs> or, uh, and then, they, then they got into then they then they, some of the albums or whatever got into saying releasing a set six set sort of ones every week. So they're saying you won't ever need to do to do swaps. I said, well, swaps was the fun of it. Yeah. The sticker your, book was mostly your, irrelevant. <gasps> Yeah, the sticker book. It was it was more to going in and taking and trading the ones. That you, if you had more than one of something, mm. taking it and trading with your school friends to see that was the fun of it. And, it's, and like whoever decided when, when they sort of decided to do that, that's kind of like um, for a year or two. It's like that took the fun out of it for me. And then I think they just bought, bought, went back to normal afterwards. <laughs> cool. There is something I collect that is really cool though. And I'm going to grab one. Well, she had to get up, so we're safe. <laughs> <laughs> Julie said husband, but she's not saying how many she's collected. Yeah. Man says one's enough. <laughs> <laughs> how many swords have you got? Uh, they're not all. They're not all ninja swords. Uh, Three full sets of the variant size ninjas. Um, most of these are display. They're not proper. One is a proper one. Um, uh, a whole heap of other swords. Some are some are legit. Some are just um, for display purposes. Uh, a couple of fantasy swords, but they're mostly actual um, replicas of real swords or actual proper real swords. Um, probably about thirty. 
So yeah, how, that, how, how exactly is it you started this entire thing saying you don't collect anything? Yeah, because I forgot <laughs> I collect <laughs> swords. <laughs> how would you forget something like that, though? Especially when they were sitting right in front of them. Well, yeah. Three of them are up there in front of me. I'm like, oh yeah, I'd collect swords. I also collect fans, but uh, you can't see them in the way the camera is. You know how there's often yes. a fan in the background. Like, yeah, I, I collect fans as well. So. <laughs> I was going to say back when I used to uh, ride motorcycles, I think speeding fines was something I used to seem to collect. <laughs> but... It's not sharp, this one. I still reckon I could hurt someone with it, though. Well, it's a piece of metal. Yes. <laughs> I, used to, I, I, used like a, I used to have like a cutlass type sword, actually, um, somewhere, but I don't know if I still have it. But... I used to have an Indian, cer uh, Indian Army ceremonial sword. Mm. I have. I have one, though. Do you? Yeah, the, the, you're talking about the flexible one? Nope. Oh, I've got the flexible version of it. It was in an orange, kind of felty metal scabbard. Uh, oh, cool. So you've got the other model. Yeah. Okay, right. cool. Well, firstly, I don't have it. I left it behind. Oh, that's a shame. Um, yeah, I've um, got one of those. Uh, I've got a... Um, Damn it! I've got I've got two um, um, guard type swords, um, which are like have the handle on the like cutlasses, but they're for parading. Um, I've also got um, oh far out! I can't remember what's called <laughs> the type of sword that the musketeers would have used. Mental blank rapier. Uh, yeah, I've got a rapier. A full length rapier, not the short one. So Aren't they like dead the thin? Beautiful... Sorry? Aren't they dead thin? Rapiers. Uh, the, the, no, you get longer ones as well. You get the thicker type as well. So. <laughs> yeah. Sammy says he collects YouTube content creators and he wants me to start his collection. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not in mint condition. Ooh. Bill. Yeah, I do, to be honest, I didn't really do much weird collecting. I collected rocks as a kid, and and I do collect bladed weapons now. Nan, Nan's got a few interesting bits that she's collected over the years, haven't you? Mm. Yeah, like your your dogs up there, which which yeah. we'll show you one of the dogs in a minute. She's got some interesting little dogs. My granddad was really the collector in the family, wasn't he? Oh, <laughs> I like that dreadful. <laughs> yeah, he was dreadful. Wait, 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 a collector or a hoarder? <laughs> yeah, that's what my question was going to be. Collector or a little bit of both, to be honest. <laughs> yeah. Like, military memorabilia, like uh, jigsaws, guns. Whoops, guns. Yeah, he, like guns. filled the house, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> You were always safe. You could shoot the burglars. <laughs> Hold on, I'll grab one of the dogs. I'll show you the Rock. dogs. You back yet, Sal? Nope. Sammy, why don't you hop in? Make up the six. Oh, oh that's quite a cool dog. Just gonna mute a second. Someone's. Oh, that's You're cool. muted, by the way. <laughs> yeah, that's one of the dogs. My uncle, that is a is a Baptist minister, was a little bit offended by that dog for some reason. But we all thought it was quite funny. I got this dog. Yeah, we got a soldier up there as well, and a and a farmer um, with a gun. With a gun. <laughs> yeah, there's a few of them. They're all great. <laughs> now I've got the sword down. I keep playing with it. You would. I actually haven't done any sword training for years, so I don't know if I'd be any good with it anymore. <laughs> I'm sure you could handle it. It's not. Oh, that I'm sure I could hurt someone. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I did. I was one grading off my black belt in Taekwondo, and I did do some weapons training as well. So I, I think I could defend myself with it if I had to. Most people, again, the sort. It's the sort of thing that having that sort of weapon, most people run. When they see someone with it. Yeah! <laughs> Especially if that person could, looks like they know how to use it. <laughs> We've got... Oh. But I, I'm not a violent person. I, I think I would have to feel incredibly threatened to be able to pick one up and use it. So... Yes. 
we, we've got the, we've got this pro with problem as, and pro I've almost certainly told you uh, we've had guard dogs well my dad's had guard dogs for 40 odd years and they've always been German Shepherds or yeah. German Shepherds Cross anyway the dog he's got at the moment is useless <laughs> right however I mean as in useless I mean it is soft as a brush however it is uh, it looks vicious yeah and it barks it's got a good good deep bark Right, but it would it, yeah. it would literally will not hurt. It, it won't even look at someone. Right. So you, you, if you've ever had a guard dog, having them next to you gives you a level of confidence. Mm. Right. Given given where I live, yeah, we, we you, you can walk out with a group of literally yobs. Yeah, you can have twenty yobs and one Alsatian next to you that's well trained, and the yobs won't do anything. Because the dog is just stood there, staring each one of them down. Yeah. Right, and the confidence you get from having that. I mean, I've run into the, I've run into, I've run into the building with burglars in there, with the dog, without a care in the world. Yeah. That, that, well, that's... Generally speaking, most people are more afraid of you than you are of them. Yes. Once you're at that point. But the dog is fantastic because they're so fast. <laughs> anyway, so the dog he's got at the moment is absolutely useless. Okay. However, because he looks the part, as long as you keep him on a lead and pretend like he's vicious, it has the same People effect. Get freaky. Yes. Right. So you just every time and he's excitable. So every time he tries to be, no, 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 stay back, <laughs> stay back, and it gives this effect. But you don't have the confidence. Not having the confidence that he's, that he's going to be that he can handle himself and look after you is what's missing. I'm gonna put the sword down before I hit myself. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that, guys. That was kind of an important call I had to take. So that's okay. They told you you've got that's to okay. stay another six weeks, haven't they? Uh, no, no, but it is about medication, actually. So yeah. I had to take it. No, no, understandable. Uh, Julie said that junk shop and her collect books. See, I would say I used to collect books. I mean, I still have one hell of a book collection. But I, I don't go out of my way to collect them anymore. Um, I, I'd rather read online <laughs> with my phone or something. I the problem I've got is I, I carried on collecting books after the point at which I was unable I, I was unable to read them, and I got a lot less joy out of them. <laughs> well, are you at the point now, Dave? Whereas by the time you get to the end of a book, you can't remember what the start was. I've got no clue. What, by the time I get to the end of the page, I can't remember what the start of the page is. <laughs> I mean, I, it's it's slightly better. Uh, with 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 on when I can read in a web browser because I can highlight where I go and I, I lose track a lot less. Um, but I still really struggle. I right. was so sure I was going to sneeze then. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Question one hundred and eighty. I'm back. Oh, oh, sounds, oh, gets out to answer the question. Oh, first of all, uh, okay, we'll do that then. Uh, what was the most unusual thing that you've ever collected? Um, um, <laughs> uh, this is gonna sound weird. Um, leaves, leaves, like different shaped leaves. Yeah, different shaped leaves. When I was a kid, I used to like pick different shaped leaves and keep them like. Keep them hidden. It was the stupidest, weirdest no, thing that's, I did. That's exactly the sort of thing. <laughs> but I mean, that's no different to people collecting shells, really. No. Or, or pressing flowers, to be quite honest. Yeah, it's a variant of pressing flowers. So I, I don't see that it's an unusual thing. No. Um, I tried collecting butterflies once, but I could never bring myself to put the pin through them. <laughs> but you killed them fine. Oh no, no, they had to be already dead. <laughs> I still can't put a pin through it. <laughs> See, I don't think that's that unusual, but I think people used to. I mean, do kids collect things now? Hmm. I used to collect T-shirts, like uh, silk screens T-shirts. Mm. I, I have a whole collection of silk screen T-shirts that I still do. Hey, Matt Big. Morning. Um, 
I suppose I do collect t-shirts, although I, again, oddly enough, it's one of those things that I have tr been trying to reduce. Um, I've, I've basically been taking photographs of the t-shirts I collected and getting rid of the t-shirts. Uh, <laughs> I have too much stuff. Hmm. I could agree there. I gotta get rid of some of my shit. If you enjoyed that, please hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down. If you think you've got a better answer or just want to tell us how wrong we are, leave a comment down below. Subscribe down here for new questions every day and make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss out on our live shows. If you click over here, you'll see our latest upload. Over here for what YouTube thinks you'll love the most. And finally, for a complete playlist of all our currently recruited least questions, click here. <laughs>